Tallest man in Scottish rugby. Tom said that there's a boy playing against him today who's even taller than him. So it's asking a lot of Doddy unless he gets the protection from the top. Well, as we can see, John, the All Blacks are now taking the field here at Neverdale for this afternoon's match. So let's immediately hand you over to our commentary team this afternoon, Sean Lanine and Bill McLaren. And from our commentary position on the terracing side of this Netherdale ground, welcome to the home of Gala Rugby Football Club, that, as you can tell, is a buzz with anticipation at the prospect of the first of the All Blacks four games in Scotland. Both sides having taken the field in the most gorgeous conditions, and with the exception of Brian Rennick for the under-the-weather Carroll Hogg, the Southfield, the side who won the district championship last month, plenty of pace in that back division, Michael Dodds in sizzling form in attack augmentation, a heavy responsibility on Craig Chalmers, the pack concede a lot of beef, Doddy Weir a key line-out figure, a combative loose forward trio, and of course the captain is Robbie Brown. And all the players lining up for this traditional start to any New Zealand game, the New Zealanders ready to perform their haka. Number seven there is uh, the captain for today, the inimitable Zin Zang Brook of Auckland, one of the seven Auckland players in this side. for the New Zealanders there. One of the sentences is that New Zealand storm is about to break and a lot of opponents have said you can say that again. And the return after injury of the youthful prodigy Lee Stesness is a feature of this New Zealand selection that carries nine cat men, power and pace in the back division, a massive pack, a line-out ranging from six feet three to six feet eight. And the captain, Zinzan Brook, in his 60th game,